This Cash Manager Rural tutorial will show you how to change the opening balance on your budget cash flow and explain the rules around when the opening balance can be changed. The opening balance on your budget cash flow can be changed if it is in a future financial year, however it cannot be altered if it is your current financial year's budget cash flow. To edit the opening balance on a future year budget cash flow, make sure the relevant budget sits on line 1 in the cash flow screen. If you need to, click on the change view button at the top of the screen and select the correct budget. Once the correct budget is on line 1, go to cash flow at the top of the screen, select edit and scroll down to balance and rates. Enter the opening balance, making sure you add a minus at the beginning of the amount if the account is in overdraft. While in this screen, you can also enter the opening GST amount. This is the figure you have either paid to the IRD or received as a refund for the last GST return in your previous financial year. If the interest is automatically calculated in your budget, you can enter the relevant information into the three boxes highlighted. Once you have entered your account information, click OK. You will now see the opening balance in the bottom left corner of your budget cash flow. If the opening balance is greyed out in your current financial year budget cash flow, you will not be able to alter it. This is because once you close the previous financial year in your database, the actual closing balance for that year rolls over and becomes the actual opening balance for your new current financial year. If the opening balance on your budget cash flow for the current financial year is different to the opening balance on your database or bank statement, this may be because unreconciled transactions or unpresented items from the previous financial year have been included and are distorting your opening balance. If the opening balance on your cash flow budget is different to the opening balance for your database, it is best if you phone our support help desk and one of our team can walk you through the steps to correct this. This is the end of our tutorial. For more information, visit our website www.crssoftware.co.nz or you can phone our support help desk on the number provided or email the team on the email provided.